Ninja release day. Uh, today we have Fail Factory, which is, uh, if anyone remembers, on my channel I actually played something very, very similar like that. That's called uh, They Suspect Nothing. It was pretty much a Gear VR game, but it uh, like it hopped onto the port train when we had before the Go Gear VR ports to the Quest certain games, and like just little library, and it was included there, and it was pretty much like I would say. Uh, a little bit like job simulatorish, vacation simulatorish game. It, it was kind of like a simulation of mini games, pretty much. Um, it was pretty fun. I mean, uh, it costs. I think, if I'm not wrong, it was 15 euro. Fail Factory is actually five euro now on the store, which I feel like with an exception of free stuff on the store, it makes the cheapest game on the store, which is weird, right? I feel like that's a little bit weird. If, because I'm, I'm not sure how much I should expect from a game that costs, like, if you would go and buy, like, three baguettes in my conversion, French one. <laughs> um, but I feel like I'm expecting pretty much the same same story with uh, they suspect nothing uh, in this game. Uh, yeah. Okay, I mean, let's try. Also, there is a co-op finally released on the Path of the Warrior, so I feel like I'm looking forward to playing that, but I think I'll do it on Rift because there are audio issues and I can't can't play it on Quest, kind of, without having them. Oh, you just go? Oh, wow. It just goes straight to this. Okay. Language. It's best enjoyed as a city experience. I mean, let's stand up for now because I don't want to change the settings. Uh, Sports Crumble. Oh, is it the developers of Scr Sports Crumble? That's cool then. Slip pod movement. I have no idea what that means. I maybe smooth locomotion. I don't know. So no game then. That's very cute though. First day at Calamity Corp. We look forward to expo <laughs> loyalty. Yeah, the same concept. Loyalty robots. Nerves. I will be responsible for your training. So like huge models in space you know I feel like I'm such a small person in like this whole environment because they the models are so huge yeah interns same ah tell us to go on the intern level jobs job stay late in front of you so we are starting in a kind of company from a lowest position and going back up, I guess. Jesus. Since you're new, the available jobs are a bit limited at the moment. Okay. Don't worry, you should have ready for more advanced work. After about yeah. <laughs> Unless there's no promotion at work, which sucks. Okay. Through our brass network transfer tow tubes. Okay, go. Jesus. I feel like this is the completion, like stars in the whole game. <laughs> Tube music. Wow. Starting station training area. Oh. 
Ok. Let's see the mechanics. Mm -hmm. Score based. Start, use trigger, hold release. Ok. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. I felt... Oh, shit, no. Oh, God damn it, I suck. Even though it's like... It seems like a kid's game. No. <laughs> I feel like I surpassed the yeah four star. It's a really fast pace, pretty much. Okay. Mm, yeah. Okay. P two P two P two P two. Jesus. So that's it. So I'm assuming. If we have 4 stars per level, it's gonna be, if my math is correct, 39 levels. Yes? I hope, yeah. <laughs> uh, that's same shit, but different colors. Okay. Yeah, straightforward. I wish I would have like in the second hand also the starting thingy. Maybe in the later levels. What is it? White? It was white. <laughs> Do I have to like guess? Oh, it's under the side. I need to like turn it or whatever. Okay. Weird. Can I? Ah, oh, I spin with that trigger. Okay. Not trigger, thumb stick. Hey. Well, that was bad. <laughs> What the hell? Uh, do I have to? <laughs> okay, fastly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, you know, I feel like I'm getting <laughs> really bored and it's just past maybe a couple minutes, you know, but at the same time, like, you can't expect, like, major things for f 5 euro, it's basically a kid's game, <laughs> right? Uh, 
can I go to the menu or something? Wait. Yeah. Coffee jockey. Ah, so that's like the next job, maybe. I would love for the next, like, last level for me. Go to the other job. Ah, yeah, yeah. I hope not starting, please. <clears throat> it's very straightforward, like there's no depth into the game. Which I felt like the They Suspect Nothing had like a little bit of storyline, a little bit of more variety. I know that there's gonna be like more jobs, like here we have something different. But I feel like the game would be just purely uh, Angry Birds of kids game, kinda, I don't know. Re See? Recycling trash. It's again like sorting. You just put things into holes. Yeah. Tilt it. Hold release. Okay. Ah, okay, here. <laughs> well, at least that's different mechanic, right? I need to, like, tilt the controller. Last one, or not, whatever. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, I actually wanna, no, I don't want next. Menu or nothing, okay. Next session, no. I'll just leave. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, it's it's hard to tell if we actually needed this game, to be honest, on the store. I mean, it's cute. It's obviously for kids. Like, I feel like you would have to have a really, like, high, intense, fucking stressful day to play this game and, like, fully enjoy it. Because it's purely casual, relaxing time. Just like some steering controller. Sitting down, basically, because you don't need to stand up at all. So it's kind of like... I would sort of uh, put it like the game, the lazy game for lazy people. Or just people who want to enjoy something brain brainless, pretty much, I guess. To just reset, <laughs> reset the day with that. Uh, so, you know. I feel like I enjoyed way more uh, They Suspect Nothing here, uh, which is pretty, f like, you know, this games kind of like have the same concept, like Angry Bird, They Suspect Nothing, Fail Factory, they all have like completion levels, score system, stars, and basic mechanics, right? Uh, but at the same time for 5 euro, it's it's fair, I would say. Yeah, it's very like cartoony, very childish. Uh nothing to be like, oh my god, game of the year. <laughs> Let's be the real here. But yeah. It's I don't feel like we needed that if, if when we got the the spec nothing port uh, from Go to the quest. But if someone is not familiar that we got it at all, here we have uh, one position in the store. Uh, yeah, I'll just 
get back to my shit, I think. 